papá es entrenador. Mi my dad's a trainer and my sister boxes too. Boxing is breakfast, lunch, and dinner for us. Comemos y cenamos bots. Que me toca hacer sparring con niños. I spar with boys and boys are really aggressive sometimes. So I feel really confident because of my preparation. If you prepare well, train, run, eat well, nothing's going to happen. If you're going to lose, it's because your opponent is better and because they're better prepared, not for any other reason. Tijuana, Baja California, Kenya, Enrique. I feel like this is my thing. I enjoy fighting, and it just seems so easy to me. I want to be a world champion. I want to be an example for my sister. I want her to want to be as good or better than me. I started training when I was 12 years old. My friends say I don't look like a boxer. They look at me and think I'm weak. They don't believe me sometimes. Every day I get up, I go for a run at 4.30 in the morning, and then I go to work. I finish around 2, and I go straight to my training, which starts at 3.30. I'm there until about 6, and then I go home and rest. My promoter calls me La Niña Sensacion, the girl sensation, because he says I'm young to be boxing. So that's the name I'm stuck with, I think, until I turn 18 and then no more. Tijuana has become in the last couple of years uh, the second uh, busiest uh, female fight town in the world, only behind two uh, Buenos Aires, Argentina. Female fighting gets a lot of support from the Mexican public, the Mexican boxing public, including TV, much more than the United States. But obviously being in Mexico and the machismo, there's a lot of people here that, that don't accept it. There's a lot of boxing gyms that don't train female fighters. You know, very good boxing gyms. Females don't get paid the same as males. You know, uh, usually it's about half, if not a little bit less. I want to be a world champion like my sister. I want for both of us to be world champions. 